These are some pages of stuff I've been working on. This is All Star Batman and Robin number nine. So you can see that I'm way ahead on this book. This is page. Oh, that's page one. So wait, hold on. I've got later pages. This is page. This is page 19. I didn't label it, but trust me, this is page 19. So you can sort of see this is how I start a page. It's looser, but uh, all the basic shapes are there and the shadows are there. And it's definitely more scribbly, um, but I know that I've blocked out my compositions. I've got my forms right. I spotted my blacks. And the rest of this I can literally do while I'm talking to someone else on the phone because it's just noodling and detail work. But this kind of stuff requires my sort of frontal cortex and... That's the tough stuff. <laughs> anyway, this is a finished page here. This is uh, Batman facing off against Green Lantern. And I originally put all these backgrounds of pipes and stuff in this building that they're in, but um, I thought it took away from sort of the impact of the sort of Clash of the Titans kind of look. And it's a very, to me, it's a very 60s, 70s sort of style composition. You would see covers and splash pages like this. Uh, back in that in those in those decades, not so much anymore. And uh, back then, they would also do these sort of excitement zoom lines that you don't really see too much of in modern day comics. So I did this sort of as an homage to uh, the style of comics that I read when I was a kid. So I erased all those backgrounds, and uh, I would say thirty percent of my uh, seventy percent of my time is drawing, and thirty percent of my time is erasing, and an extra twenty percent of my time is redrawing. So that's one hundred twenty percent. That's how much. I put into every page. It's not just 100, 120%. Anyway, these are other pages that are sort of halfway finished, so you can see that's kind of tighter, and these scribbles here represent stalagmites because they're hanging. It's like tights, tights. Tights up the top, mites coming up. This is Robin with his bow and arrow, so again, you sort of see where uh, I have like little notes to the anchor, tissue smudge the edges because I'm too lazy to do it myself, and just things like that. And Scott Williams uh, has been my anchor for almost 15 years, and he's just amazing. He takes this stuff and makes it look fantastic. Fantastic.